Hi right, guys, thought I'd do a, a quick intro to um, a video that I've just started compiling. So yeah, I bought this solar panel a few weeks ago, thought I'd give it a, a couple of tests out in the garden in different conditions. Um, the first test was slightly overcast with a little bit of sun breaking through and the second test was um, just pure solid sun. Um, temperature's been quite good lately as you all know and uh yeah the tests were brilliant i was um, more than happy with with the output um so yeah let's head on over to the video and have a closer look there you go guys there's the easy act solar panel in its folded format measuring six by one by 12 inches it weighs 1.2 kilos so nice and lightweight it's got four panels and we'll have a look now at the text on the case you can see there five volts four amp max output um, and although it's really well made i wouldn't really want to leave it out in the rain and there you go in the wallet itself you've got the the four outputs you can see there two smart and two standard one amps and there's a little bit of room left in there for a couple of little bits and bobs and a couple of cables You can see here by the reflection in the table there that um, it's not full sun today. It's sort of intermittent, really. You know, a bit of sun breaking through the clouds, which I thought was ideal, really, to do a, a bit of an experiment. They're not um, completely accurate and scientific um, tests, but I'm sure you'll get an idea of the output. Um, I put a couple of smartphones on it yesterday um, one was at low 20 percent i think it might be 21 22 percent and the other one was smack on 30 percent um, i put them both in a smart port and they both charged to 100 percent in less than two hours which i was i was chuffed with right and this is my usb head torch which draws about a third of an amp when I plug it into the 230 volt socket you can see here that it's actually drawing around about a third of an amp so almost identical to what it draws out the mains like I say there you go that's a nice steady output there I just want to add that um, when I was looking through these various solar panels on websites, um, particularly Amazon, um, I had a look at the reviews on this one and then I flicked over to another website and I had a look at the Ridge Monkey, which was rated at a uh, 16 watt output, um, but that was £30 more expensive than this and it only had the two outputs. So I flicked back to Amazon and I had a look through the the reviews again on this one and uh, obvious to say but yeah I opted for this and I'm really happy with it and there you go that's drawing virtu virtually the same as what what it does from the 230 socket and it's still not full sun by the way just put the Ridge Monkey bivy light in and see what that draws but it should be around about 400 milliamps I never seem to uh, get a definitive answer on how long this charges because it's, it's one of those things where I just usually plug it into the wall 
walk away and forget all about it you know so got really nothing to compare it to but anyway guys um if you're thinking of buying a solar panel then you can do a hell of a lot worse than this one and like i say it's uh, it, it's a good output 28 watts is very respectable and uh having said that let's have a a look at this last chargeable item and like I say it should be about uh, 400 milliamps there we go so not far off that about 370 milliamps anyway guys cheers for watching um, I'll drop some links in the description below see ya